Welcome back to Just Scribble for an unboxing of my June stationery selection sub box and an unboxing of the pre-order that I had placed with the stationery selection for the collab between Courtney Diaz and the Superior Labor. So we're going to open the collab first because I ordered this in the spring. I opted to have them wait to send it until they had a correction made for a postcard and stickers that were to go with the collab. And so I just had them hold on to it until those were ready. So they sent it with my June box and I want to open that first and and then we will get into my June sub box. So you probably know who Courtney Diaz is, but if you don't, she is Little Raven Inc. on Instagram. She is based out of Sydney, Australia, and she is just an amazing artist. She does have a Patreon in addition to her Instagram, so I'll put links to that down in the description box below as well. With this pre-order, we got this cute postcard that she designed. I'm going to turn it sideways so you guys can see it nicely, but it has her beautiful artwork on it. And on the back, it is just a blank postcard. So you could use this to actually send a postcard to somebody snail mail, or you could tip this into your journal and then you could journal on this side and have the cute little picture on the other side. I did get the little card from the stationery selection. This is the business card for the stationery selection with their Instagram, Facebook, and also website details. And then we got some stickers designed by Courtney. This one is a sticker, and then these are journaling cards. But this says, your journal is where art and life collide. So cute. This journaling card says, I love stationery a lot. And on the back, it has little monsters and a place where you could journal. This one says, proud pen lover. It has a little grumpy monster on there. And then a different monster on the back with the grid for journaling. And this one says, I smell notebooks. I love this one. It's so cute. And on the back, it just has a little scribble and some faux washi and a place to journal. So we got those three journaling cards. And then we got some washi designed by Courtney. I'm going to open this up real quick. But it has her signature little monsters on it. So there are six monsters and then the monsters repeat and they are all her little drawings of the monsters. They are so cute. I'm so excited for this washi. It is adorable and it is a vertical washi. I've mentioned before, whenever I get vertical washi, I get very excited. So it's not very often that you get a vertical washi that's not just a deco washi, but one with some sort of drawing or picture on it that runs vertically. And I like those because they're nice to put either down by the seam of your book or on the edge of the page of your book. So we got the washi and then we got the superior labor pouch that was the collab between Courtney and the superior labor. So it has their logo here and then it has this really pretty periwinkle color at the bottom and then the pink here, the hot pink there with the gold zipper. Take out the superior labor card and it just sits like that. So cute. I love my superior labor pouches. I've gotten them all through the stationery selection and I absolutely love them. I use them all the time and I'm really excited for this one because to me it is super cute for summer. So that was the little Courtney Diaz collab that I had pre-ordered. But this is my June sub box. So I have not even cut it open yet. So I'm going to cut it open and we're going to check it out. If you are not subscribed to the sub boxes from the stationery selection, they have some amazing things that they've been doing sneak peeks of that are coming up, including some of the new Stalogy A5 notebooks. If you hadn't seen it, Stalogy is coming out with both dot grid and plain notebooks to go along with the grid ones that they normally sell. And one of those designs is going to be in a future stationery selection sub box. And there's been some other awesome sneak peeks too. So if you haven't subscribed yet, now is definitely the time to subscribe because some awesome things are coming. But we're going to check out my June box. So this is the June box and they went back to the normal style of writing out what's in the box instead of the little doodles. I have one from April. This is what we had gotten the last couple of boxes with the cute little doodles. I actually really like this because the doodles I think are adorable, but they can provide more information about the items when they do it this way with the writing. First thing we got is an El Commune tickle brooch. 
you can get either a white or a black in your box. The colors vary between white and black, but it is a but it is a brooch with a felt bird on it. So you could stick this onto your backpack or your Defonics pouch or wherever you want to keep the little pin. But it is a cute little soft felt bird. Is and it's like a little safety pin brooch on the back. The next thing we got is a Hygentia Block Memo. I'm sure that I pronounced that completely wrong. And it's just a cute little notepad that has highlights of many of the tourist attractions of Tokyo. And they're just cute little pictures of the different attractions. The colors on these are so beautiful and vibrant. And you could set this on your desk just to have a little notepad or you could tear them out and you could tip these in to your planner or your journal. But they are so pretty and it is a lot of pages. So we got that block memo and then we got a seed eraser. This is a radar style eraser. It is a twist style eraser. So what's unique about this is its shape. So it is a triangular eraser so that you can get into little corners if you need to, and then it twists to expose the eraser when you need more. And it's very tiny and compact, so it won't take up any room in your planner pouch. The next thing we got is a set of Kita washi strips. These are from King Jim. I have shared Kita washi strips in the past. I love Kita washi strips. And this one is in the style called Picnic. It's just a super portable way to carry some washi tape or decorative tape with you to add into your planner or your journal. So the way it works is each one has a backing on it and you just peel the backing off and you stick the little washi strip onto your planner page or your journal page. So this one is the Picnic style. And they just close up kind of like a matchbook. And then, and then you have a slim little washi strip set to carry with you in your planner pouch, or you can stick it into the pockets of your notebook cover or journal cover. Next thing we got is a Kokio mechanical pencil in a 0.5. Let's see if I can get this open and show you guys. So this pencil is hexagonal in shape, so it won't roll off your desk, which is super nice. It is really, really lightweight and you don't have to take the cap off to fill the lead. So it has a very unique filling system. It's just a very nice, sleek mechanical pencil to add to your pencil bag. And then the last thing we got is a canvas pouch. This is a 100% cotton pouch without any paraffin. This is a smaller company and they have been working on new ways to create their products and sew their products to, to limit the amount of dust and waste that they are creating and make their products more sustainable. So it's an awesome company to be supporting and Mitz found it recently. I take this off, let's see, how does this work? So it has a snap here. I'm gonna take off the little tag and it opens up like that. It has a little bit of a gusset to it, so it is not perfectly flat, but it is still thin and streamlined. And then you just fill it up, fold that back over, snap it closed. So that is our June stationary selection sub box. We got the Canvas pouch. We got the Kokio mechanical pencil. We got the Kita washi strips. We got the seed eraser the block memo pad, and the little felt brooch. So that is our June box. I'm in love with it. I'm very excited to use this pouch, and I really like this memo pad. I'm definitely going to get a lot of use out of that, and I always love my keto washi strips. So that is our June box, and then this is my order from the collab between the Superior Labor and Courtney Diaz Little Raven Ink, my little Superior Labor pouch, my journaling cards, my sticker, my postcard, and my washi tape. So that is my unboxing from the stationery selection. If you have any questions about anything that I shared in this unboxing, please don't hesitate to comment below and I will definitely get back with you. Make sure you are subscribed so you don't miss future videos and don't forget to just scribble.